Hello everyone and thank you for 500,000 visits and push Mary down the stairs. You wanna ask about push Mary lore? That's why I'm here to answer your questions and don't worry, after after this video, you can still submit in the forms. I love answering questions. So the first one is, would you ever consider doing the rest of the black space rooms? I don't know actually. The point, black space for me, the black space in Omori is very scary, if I'm being honest, and there's so many memes that's been there, right, about the, the melon. Black space is very popular in Omori, and of course, you know, people would really want to suggest like, oh, you should make the black space rooms. But the only thing that I'm really scared of is Roblox moderation. If you didn't know, I got banned for like a day because of this image. I know. He, that looks like a particular painter. I don't want to risk it again. So, you know, like, I don't know. We need to talk to someone that is like, you know, good at Roblox if Black Space is like safe. Because, you know, there are some, there's some Black Space images that might, you know, you might give a raise. There are some Black Space images that might give Roblox mods, like, you know, a raise in their eyebrows and maybe ban me and i don't want to do that so for now i've been thinking about it but i really can't due to roblox limitations so hopefully i can do it we will never know are you proud of your game or do you regret making it but have to stick it with it or stop i'm very proud of my game because you know if it it was a simple joke at first and now it became so big we got so many locations and more to come i'm really proud on what happened to the game you know this is what like unexpected uh life uh what, what do you call it it's very unexpected it's like my whole life changed because just because if a simple joke and push mary and look, now we have a community around it. We are, we are, we have so much stuff to help. We even have morphs. So this, so I really, I'm really proud of the game that I made, and I'm really proud of you guys to keep on support, supporting me. And it really, it really makes me happy whenever people love uh, Push Mary. Every messages that you guys uh, tell me, or like any, like go. Oh, Thank you, Len, for making this awesome game. It really warms my heart and it makes me... That's like my fuel for being motivated and making more updates and stay committed to this game. It's because of you guys. And thank you so much because of it. What are you planning for the rest of the year on Gilded, Discord, and Pushmary? That's a nice touch. Guys, you can join Gilded too. We have a Gilded server and a Discord server too. I don't have any plans on Gilded and Discord. They're just servers you can talk. I feel like we can make... I, I made Gilded as a second option. Like, for example, if Pushmary Discord server is a bit, you know, is a bit active and, you know, you can't chat in there, you can also chat in Gilded. There's also some other players that wants to go in Gilded, like there's so many stuff in there that's different to Discord, so you know, you guys can have a choice, but still the same thing. And my my plan for Push Mary for the rest of the year, I don't really have any plans for the rest of the year, but I have plans for projects that that is very important and needed to update on push mary so hopefully we need to do it but we just need like we need we just need patience guys we just need to wait because scripters are working hard on it even me i'm working hard on this in the project that i'm making that would you know that is a great that that will be hopefully great okay i don't have any leaks yet i don't want to say anything it's just i'm working on something very special and i don't want to say it are you going to make the whole Omori map? I don't think so. I don't know. The Omori map is very big, but I don't I don't think we can get all of them. Since this is just a Roblox game, there's really nothing to like, you know. I mean, this is 
what it is now. Kushumeri is all about new locations and morphs and basically a social hangout game where you also explore to different worlds, to different crappy worlds. Well, I don't know. It, it looks weird to me, but maybe or maybe not. Uh, all I can say, I'm not planning to like make all of the maps in Mori. It's just I want to expand the ones that needed to expand, like Sweetheart's Castle, the other world, the improved other world, the other, the improved vast forest, and other future locations to come. If people want it, I will make it. I will make it. So. I don't have any plans like making the whole Omori map. It's just if people suggested this particular map, I might do it. It depends. When did you originally start working on this project? That's this is not a project. This is not like a fan project thing where I planned like to make a similar game out of Omori sandbox. If you look at my other video where I discussed about the old versions of Push Mary, you can see there that it's just really a joke game. You just press the button and push Mary. That's really all. You know, yeah, that is really all. Imagine if I just stopped there because this is just a simple joke. There's really nothing more in it. But I did. I added more rooms and then it leads to new locations. And more and more and more and people since people kept playing it I don't want to just let it die I want I want them to have a reason or I want them to stay in my game and that's how what's happening right now there's like events there's like chances there's like so many locations to explore from there's more to there's morphs so you can you know enjoy and stay there and do wacky stuff there's so many stuff really and really it makes me happy and how this game has become right now also they like chocolate milk i love chocolate milk you know chocolate milk is like the best thing ever like it's i already like milk imagine if i drank chocolate milk oh my god there's a lot of questions <laughs> that's okay well i have a list of questions so we can pick as many as you want number one did you expect so many people to enjoy push mary or you thought I would uh, you would stay under the radar um i never expected people to play this game when i first made it i saw people playing it because of the visits there's like 10 visits 100 it only went from 100 and i was like whoa what the hell people are playing it but i never saw people playing it like there's one playing or something like that so i kept updating it and Sometimes there's like one people playing. I, I just waited, really. If I'm gonna be honest, in the early days of Push Mary, where no one actually knows about that, I sometimes I would wait for someone to play it and join them. That's how. Uh, that's how I'm. I'm just happy. Just someone describing my game, and I want. I want to go there, and you know. Yeah, it's really fun, and now. Uh, over the you know over the months uh, the months passed there's like you know one to five people are playing and then sometimes it's five to ten and the most rarest thing back then was ten I would never expect ten people playing that game until you know and now we have like twenty people playing to even seventy or even a hundred at one point that is a lot and thank you guys really so much for continuing supporting Push Mary. Number two, what is your favorite thing about Push Mary? Well, my favorite thing about Push Mary is people is the people itself. My favorite thing about Push Mary is the community. They're always so wacky, but if it's not about that, then I like planning things. That's my favorite thing about if if I guess like on development wise, I like the pl I like the planning part since. It's like, oh, what if we make this and that? And then, you know, the, you know, the sad part is that you need to wait. <laughs> you need to wait for those ideas to come into reality. So, yeah. Number three. Do you have a plan to, like, the far future? Not only for your game, but also for yourself? Um, maybe, yes. I have, I have lots of plans to just not make Push Mary, but related to Push Mary. But I have been always dreaming about 
you know, just I've been thinking about also like making my own game. But, uh, but yeah, let, let's see. I've always been, I always want to dream about making. I have, I have lots of, I have lots of ideas. And if I'm gonna be honest, I have an idea about this burger place where it's just like the game it's just like the game that gas station simulator game but it's you work at a burger place and once we were like doing work on it uh i i was very sad when i searched burger place and there was an actual exactly this idea that i have on the burger uh place that i planned um there's even a document for it on what to focus and stuff and i really feel bad that someone made it so making a game is very hard because People can do whatever they want nowadays, and you don't really have originality. So, so you gotta be careful on making your game because maybe it might be too similar or too, you know, too predictable. So yeah, what is the most exciting thing you want to add to Push Mary, but you can't because Roblox limitations are copyright? The black space one. Again, Roblox limitations. I don't want to get banned, so I really don't want to touch black space and black space the location is the thing that i really really hate the only genius thing on the on the black space location is the basil blender thing that's really all <laughs> that's all that i really like the other ones are pure rushed they only was rushed just so i can put like oh look at this i made black space and omori sandbox is not I really hate black space. It's it's a mess. There's really nothing in there and it's just mm. number five. What is your thought process for the events in Push Mary? If you have one. Thought process is it is that like thinking about how to make it? Like planning, I guess? Well, you know, sometimes the events that I think just immediately goes up into my mind and say, Oh, that's a good idea. If I'm gonna be honest, that's what it is. Some I don't think about it it's on it suddenly came to my mind like the kel one the kel you know the kel bowling ball or something like that i suddenly think of that because people are playing so much in the lobby and i want to punch them so i put a kel there so they can all of them get killed it's really funny number six do you think you could do a collab with omori sandbox one day well, that would be a dream come true if that actually happened. Omori Sandbox is the best Omori game in Roblox. You can't deny that. I mean, Omori Sandbox was here like years and years and I am just a new guy. And who cares about the new guy? Omori Sandbox, I got inspired so many things on Omori Sandbox and they are, uh, it's really great. Omori Sandbox is still popular today without any updates. It shows that Omori Sandbox is a great game to meet friends, to roleplay, really great. Uh, Omori Sandbox, uh, I really want to do a, I, I really want to do a collab on that. I don't think uh, they would allow like sharing morphs like, oh, you can have this morph and I can have your morph. That's not a good idea, I think. Maybe a good collab idea is just like an event. Like, oh no, the Omori Sandbox people have overtaken Push Mary. I mean, that's a good event where we need to escape and stuff. It's a whole story. It's That's a good... I don't know. I don't know what would be the collab of Omori Sandbox. Maybe like we work together, which is maybe possible. I mean, I don't know. We talk, me and Tex actually talked from some time when it was a Christmas event, I told him like, would it would it be funny if I put your Sunny model in my model just for Christmas? So they would get surprised like, oh my god, it's Sunny in the Christmas event. And I for and yeah, that's a bad idea. So I don't know, I don't know about the collab on Amore Sandbox. I don't know what would really happen, but that would be a dream come true. Just. Omori Sandbox and Push Mary, you know, just being friends and not having some arguments because I don't want any like drama or something and I feel like there's some people there that kept saying like, oh, Omori Sandbox is better. Um, 
both of the games are better in my opinion i mean there's really no there's really nothing why would you hate someone i mean i don't like people going with sides even though i do also you know go on sides of course i would take push mary this side but let's think about omori sandbox too let's think about the other choice before we team up and maybe you know and maybe and as far as I can say, Omori Sandbox and Push Mary, they are really great. Really, really great. Vocalite event in Push Mary. Oh no, next question. <laughs> How was your time making the game like? Very boring, if I'm gonna be honest. It's like tiring, it's like work, but it's not really work, it's your hobby. So, you know, sometimes just to you know waste time or like just so i'm productive i always play a random video in the background while i'm building and sometimes it could be a youtube video it sometimes it could be a cartoon like the simpsons or you know or a youtuber like linus tech tips it's some it's somewhere in that thing and sometimes i listen to music but sometimes i get too motivated and not even think about the game <laughs> but yeah making the game is really fun but the building part is very boring but the planning part is the best part ever in my opinion are there plans to implement quest at any point no matter the size well that is a great question from someone listen to this we actually wanted to implement quest in push mary since you know like that was last year that was in december we were thinking like should we go with quest or should we go with something else quest or more quest or more quest and more that's it that's what's in my mind right now since should be should 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 be should we be like should we be like omori's handbox or should we try something new and i decided to go with the morphs and i'll give you a reason why because quest is nice Quest is a good idea, but quest I don't quest is a good idea, but the problem is what do you do actually? Like maybe like oh basil there's a basil NPC and asking like can you pick me ten flowers or something like that? My problem about quest is that this is an Omori game. I I'm there's some there's sometimes i have this uh sometimes i'm not proud of my game because it's really just made by omakat omori is made by omakat and i i it's i don't want to make a whole game out of omori since i don't want to make i don't want to make this like a very popular game to even to non omori people i want this game to be like a social hangout where people uh, people with Omori and new to Omori fans uh, come and join and meet friends. I don't want quests since you could also grind for them, you know, you could grind in them. It's just, I don't want this to be an actual game. It's just because I don't want people to grind on a game that is just really Omori. Like, they could use that time to go and play Omori. It's just... I don't know. I'm really sorry, but yeah, that's the only problem in with Quest is that do you think Omakat would approve of that? Because we already, you know, we already use so much assets, and I don't want this to make an actual game where you know we can have an actual community. Like you know, we already have Push Mare community, but it's just you know, I don't know. It felt th this. It felt like it felt like making Quest. Or push mary would like ruin the game or just you know like making omakat not proud like make maybe omakat would think like oh no this is a cash cash cow game and i don't want that since you know quest is you just go and grind and do stuff and, and i don't want that maybe if omakat likes that we will do that but i don't know i'm i don't know for now i'm very sorry what do you have in mind for the game? Oh, I have lots of plans. I kept telling you guys about this and I don't want to overpromise, but we have a plan 
for push Mary that would change the mechanics. We would change the leaderboards, we would change the leader stats, we would change those things. We will still keep them, but we will still keep them, but um this thing could probably change push Mary. Not a lot, but just so you guys can also enjoy, but also at the same time have like a new mechanic for the game so you know you don't feel like oh push mayor is the same thing again and this thing is an absolute game changer that is like an additional mechanic that you guys might enjoy i'm not saying like oh my god it's like life changing oh my god you guys will use this it's just another game for you guys to love not, not another game sorry another mechanic that you guys might want it's a really great idea by my friend and we're working on it we're, uh, it stopped actually development, but we're working on it again. But we have so many stuff and I'm really excited on the stuff that's in there. And that is all the questions that we have. Thank you guys really for the questions that you submitted. I really like answering this. It's just, you know, it's fun. I'm very sorry. It's just I'm really happy right now that people care and question about the game and uh thank you guys really if you guys have any questions you can you can you can submit in this form or you can chat that in youtube comments thank you really guys so much and let's see what will happen in the future of push mary and it's me len the maker of push mary oh no <laughs> oh no push mary <laughs> i'm joking but yeah but yeah, hope you guys enjoy more future updates on Push Mary. And I'll see you guys again in the next... Uh, I don't know. I don't know actually. I don't know how to make an outro. <laughs> End.